So today I start with a YouTube apology video as to why I am inactive. <laughs> I swear to god, I promised I was gonna be active. The only problem is, um, if you guys are not familiar, I am from the Philippines and you guys are not don't know the culture in the Philippines is we go back to the province every Christmas season or wherever your main family is from. Um, and that's where we celebrate. So we celebrated there for like a week and I was gone. There was so much stuff uh, I was missing. But anyways, um, let's start off and you know get uh, get get to it because why not? Thank God these guys are like gonna last for a while, <laughs> not like a week. But okay, let's start off with Demon Hunter Siren Siren Siren. I have no idea. Let's just call her Yuiko. So, we're gonna start with Demon Hunter Yuiko, which is a back cloud unit. And take note, you'll know it from here already. She is actually the Momo Taro of the back row, in case you guys did not know. So, let us discuss if she is worth your gems or not. But you guys have to listen, because this stage has no steps at all. Um, so, we'll be talking about that. They look the same, it's just kind of lame. I hope they amped up the design a little more. But, um, she has basic act, you guys know that. She has a new thing which is called Pressure Strike, wherein she gives AP up to 3 rear enemies, which is really really nice because it's back row meta. That's really smart. Um, so she has Severing Strike, which is a 3 AP skill, medium damage, and removes continuous uh, positive effects of all enemies. It's like cleanse. So she is a cleanser and a debuffer as well. So, um, what she does is what Momotaro does. But I guess um, in a better way, I'd say. Okay, so she removes continuous positive effects like Momotaro. Um, add power down and special defense down, very high damage to all enemies. Okay, this will benefit her because she is special damage. The only thing is, um, it doesn't lower normal defense as well. So, um, the difference of her and Momotaro is she has act down. Wait, hold up. Does Momotaro have act down as well? Wait, wait let me pause. <gasps> Okay, okay, okay. Um, my bad. I just checked. So Momotaro does it better because she lowers the normal defense as well. But I think um it is okay. They are both good. Um, the only difference is she lowers special defense only. Um, okay. So let's talk about her more. She has a unit skill of a lame one. She has counter heal at the start. She has passive damage and. Damage received minus 10%, which is really, really nice. It's built in to her, meaning she'll deal a lot of damage. That's for sure. Okay, so let's get into detail. Is she good? Is she good? Is she good for PvE? Maybe, I'd say. Um, just because of the counter heal. Maybe also for her event bonus and the burst. But I don't think she is a PvE focused. Um, unit. Um, even though it says she is part of the um, challenge review support, I, I I I don't see it. She is good for PvP. Why? You guys know Momotaro is always in PvP. If you ban all of the units, Momotaro will just be there watching and waiting to be like you know cleansing y'all and everything. So of course, the um, the memoirs I suggest for her is also perfect aim. Um, which is the full side or just give her the basic, you know, um, what do you call this? Aquarium. Okay, so she is nice because she gives AP up, which is really, really useful. She also cleanses, which is also useful, just like the new units right now. She is one of those cleansers with the 3 AP because obviously she deals damage this time. Um, so this is like, like... 20 phase Claudine's kind of familiar um, and she has a very nice climax act so if you guys do not have Agent A if you guys do not have Queen of Hearts if you guys don't have Zeus or, the, uh, or like Momodaro this is a good replacement 
if your units get banned and you don't have all of them in your team, she is a good replacement as well. Um, but is she worth your gems? Okay, this you guys have to listen. This is the problem. So we know that she's strong. She's a really good unit. I actually spent one step, and then when I realized, whoa, hold up. Why does the second step look like this? Why does it not say that I'm step two? The thing is, the problem with um, this banner is it is not a step up banner. If you guys don't know what a step up banner is, this is what it looks like. So a step up banner is um, multiple rate ups, multiple chances to get four stars, and multiple times for you to roll in order for you to uh, no, uh, how do you say this? In order for you to get your gems wasted <laughs> in, in the best way, uh, basically it's more worth it. Okay, so if you take a look at this, um, first step is half off. Second step is three times rate for four stars. Fourth, next is four times rate for four stars. Um, and once you reach step six and seven, you get rate up for the Mao herself. And you get two times rate up for the Mao herself again. So that's in this banner. The problem is, um, Yuiko does not have a step up, meaning she's just gonna be on point two rates the whole time. There is no guarantee for you, and it will be really hard to get her unless you are a whale like Kyosuke. <laughs> but yes, okay. So, um, is she worth your gems? As a unit, yes. Is she worth your gems when you pull for her in this step up banner or banner? No. I highly recommend you to not even pull a single pull. I I didn't even read at the start. I just went click. Oh. Wait, we're step two. No, there's no step two because there's no steps. But yes, um, don't pull for her unless you're rich. That's it. Don't pull for her unless you're rich. And remember, her Hermit Mahiru is coming in two days. And that's why we are all saving right now, especially on my guildmates. But yes. So I hope you guys enjoyed this short video. I'm sorry for being late. It is Christmas season. I'm trying to be active, but you guys know me, I'm always busy. But anyways, at least I was able to make this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, a comment, and subscribe. Check out my Twitch channel because I always practice PvP there. And see you guys a next time. Peace.